Venezuela was discovered by Christopher Columbus on his third voyage to the New World. Originally, there were three tribes who inhabited the land, all of which were very skilled in the agricultural arts. The primary food source for these tribes was in the grasslands of the Llanos. This area was very rich and very nutrient to the indigenous tribes. As time went on, more and more settlers came from Europe to colonize the New World. Tensions arose between Spain and her New World colonists as the motherland demanded wealth while the colonists demanded freedom. Early in the 19th century, Spanish colonists wanted freedom from Spain. However, Spain wasn't going to give up the fruits of their empire so easily. The beginning of the revolution was met with failure. However, the young and ambitious leader Simon Bolivar rallied the militia and kept morale high. The rebels finally had their first victory in Colombia in 1820. After the defining moment, Many of Spain's colonies were liberated by Simon, and the Spaniards were pushed back. Venezuela was liberated from Spain in 1821. However, the hardships and struggle for the Venezuelan people were soon to come. Years after the Bolivarian revolutions, Venezuela was met with very many domestic problems. Many dictators came and went, and Venezuela wouldn't see any success until the 1900s, when oil was found. Even though Venezuela is the fifth largest exporter of oil in the world, the profits obtained are reserved for the upper class and the elites, whereas the lower class barely see a dime. The current leader of Venezuela is Hugo Chavez. He's seen here with a picture of his boyfriend, Fidel Castro, enjoying a nice lunch together. 